weeks after APD said it would overhaul its overtime policies with the focus on one former officer. A newly published city audit shows it's not just one officer raking in massive amounts of money in OT. Here's News 13's Chris McKee. A report from the city's Office of Internal Audit shows from July 2019 through June 2020, four people at APD made an extra $90,000 worth of overtime by working about 38 hours of OT per week. I think especially with the nosedive and the number of officers manning the streets of Albuquerque over the last 10 years, as, we've, as the number has reduced over those 10 years, the department has become more reliant on overtime to make up the difference. Now with this latest audit, APD says there are no allegation of fraud tied to those officers who worked that OT. The recent city audit was finalized on October 28th. That is one day before APD announced a series of what they called overtime restrictions and accountability measures. That announcement focused on now former officer Simon Drobik as a source of quote overtime abuse. But that audit suggests other issues. One example, more than 60 times officers were overpaid by getting paid for scheduled hours instead of hours that they had actually worked. Now, in response, APD says it will claw back any overpayments and they'll also be putting in more supervisor OT approval standards. To make sure that they're doing a better job, and I think it was lacking in the past, a better job of ensuring that those hours officers are working legitimate overtime, they're working every hour of it, and that they're doing a service, doing the public a service by, by utilizing that overtime. APD says it is also limiting officers to 25 hours of overtime per week. On average, the city has paid out around $18 million in OT to APD officers each year over the past two years. That's about 8 to 10 percent of the department's budget. Back to you. Okay, Chris. APD says it will also start spot checking officers time cards for accuracy. The state auditor is still reviewing APD's overtime practices.